Hello everyone. So now it's time for explaining of mail merge. What is mail merge? Mail merge is writing a body of the letter and sending it to multiple recipients at the same time. Suppose I am writing a letter with a simple body which is called or which is named as hello everyone. I want to send this letter to many of my friends, two or three of my friends. But the context is the body of the letter should remain the same. Only the names and addresses of the recipients will change. Only they will receive the addresses with the same body of the letter. So this body of the letter which remains constant throughout the process is called your main document. This is totally unchanged. It will not change at all. What will change are the names and addresses and the details. So in order to start with mail merge, we will have to proceed with the mailings tab. In the mailings tab, we will choose the option start mail merge. Click on this arrow and choose the option of step by step mail merge wizard. Click on this then an operation or an uh, or a window will open up on the right side on this right side window you will have total of six steps the first two steps are very easy first document which is present over here is called letters no need to change anything choose the option next starting document the second option or the second step rather again no need to change anything Choose the option, use the current document. Click on next, select recipients. Here we have to choose the names of the addresses and uh, names and the addresses to whom we are sending the letter. We will choose the option, the third one, type a new list and then click on the create. As soon as you choose the option create, the new address list box opens up with multiple uh, column names. We don't need so many column names. We need to delete the column names one by one. How we are going to delete that? We are going to click on this option called customize columns. Click on this. These are the field names which are present. I don't want these many field names. I just want three field names. Let's keep it very simple. I want only three field names, first name, last name and city. So what I'll do, I'll click, select the field names which I do not want, click on the delete option, click on yes. Do it this way individually for all the fields. So first name, last name and city. Keeping these three in mind, I'll delete all of them. One by one delete everything apart from the three fields which are required click on ok you'll see first name last name city these three fields are already there now suppose I want to fill it up so I am typing the names of the recipients to whom I want so I am typing this city say Kolkata then click on new entry I'll choose a new entry I'll choose a new entry again I'll choose a new entry so I am choosing it at present for four students Kolkata, Chennai, Delhi and Mumbai then I'll click on OK so this, these are the four people to whom I want to send the address or to whom I want to send this mail click on ok I'll save the option or I'll send this address list this is my address list I'll save this address list click on the save option and this address list will open up the saved option click on ok then now my address list is done now two things I need to do 
number one my main document is ready which is my main document this is my main document hello everyone which is my data source the data source is the address list which I have already created next step I want to merge this data source with the main document I want to put them together at the same time so I'll choose the option next write your letter over here then I'll click on this option at the top insert merge field where will I insert merge field before hello everyone so before hello everyone I am going to insert merge field choose the first name give a space again insert merge field last name next line I'll write insert merge field and choose the option city so it will come as first will come the first name next will come as last name followed by the city if you want to give any special salutation like dear so and so you will go over here greeting line address block like this you click on address block these are the options this is how it will look like it shows a preview over here it shows a preview of how it is going to look like I am going to choose greeting line I am choose dear such and such so it, it see over here it shows dear Rajan Vani so I will click on ok and the greeting line will come over here next I will choose next preview your letters now you will find that letters are already present you will see this is the first letter Rajan Vani Kolkata dear Rajan Vani hello everyone now in this place of hello everyone you can also write happy new year you can also write happy diwali you can write uh, merry christmas you can write a generalized message for everyone now how you are going to move across these messages at the top over here you will find the navigation bar or at the right side over this you will click on this arrow see the address has changed next next person has come again third person has come again fourth person has come over here you can also choose the previous letter and the next letter you can choose it from here this is your first record so if you are on record 4 you can move back to record 1 this is your previous record so if you are on record 4 you can move back to record 3 this is your next record so from 1 to 2 and this is for the last record say 2 to 4 so the last record option will be visible over here finally choose the option of next complete the merge done and lastly if you want to give some individual message to any person a special person so your best friend is person X you want to add a special message to your best friend so click on this edit individual letters which record do I want current record so this is my current record I want to edit the current record I'll click on this ok if you want only the second letter to be edited so from 2 to 2 you write from 2 to 2 so only the second record will be edited if you want to edit all the records choose the all the records click on ok and you'll find all the records are present one by one four pages are here all the records are present one by one now next thing you can do is you can mail this attachment to different individuals you can save this option on any specific location if you don't want to save it then also it's fine you can just copy paste the letters one by one but it's advisable that you save the record one by one so these are your letters I, do, I don't want to save it as of now next it come back if you want to go back to any previous of your steps choose this previous step but usually this is the final step of mail merge I hope all of you have understood I'll come back again with a new video thank you everyone